What's going on my guys? Welcome back to my channel. I'm Garrett with Game by the Beach. Very excited to be here with you today because we are going to be playing around a little bit. He's hit me with the mallard. He must know who I am. I'll hit him with the dancing mallard. We are playing around with a little bit of robot and we want to see how he fares on the ladder. We're doing an OG robot deck right here which is robot and stasis i almost always will take bombardier over stasis but here we are okay stasis can be really strong it can feel a little bit weak at times we're gonna find out today which one is gonna show up in today's video and it should be a little bit interesting so he's already got some stuff attacking one of the first things i want you guys to see is that i'm actually using gadget here today um, we're gonna combine out this way Because I really want to push the issue on damage and kind of lo lasting long throughout the game Rather than trying to finish the game early where I would use you know, maybe trickster or maybe clock of power Maybe snowflake something like that. I want to try and go further in the game than my opponent and, uh, and I actually set up our board and see kind of the full uh, array of damage and how long a robot really can last but if you guys are enjoying this video make sure that you are subscribed to the channel like the video and also check out those memberships we got a lot of cool perks i know you guys will enjoy including the ongoing raffle for you to win your very own mallard mug all you gotta be is a rare member let's push all this information out there before we end up losing 20 seconds all we gotta do is get to a fifth merge and uh, and I think we'll be in a pretty solid spot. So let's see we can do that We can actually merge here here and can we do one more. I Guess we'll have to do this six seconds. Yikes. Can we fight all the way back? So he's got priestess in his deck we've got Stasis in our deck. So realistically he should have the advantage early on Nice we actually got that switch. He should have the advantage early on and hopefully that means that we have the advantage later on. That's kind of the way I'm thinking about this. We made it through wave one. We did get to our fifth merge, but our board does not look fantastic. If you look at his board, he's got a four, he's got a two, a two, a one, another four, a bunch of twos. He's got a lot of things going on on that board. So let's try and focus a little bit more on summoners. There's a three, that's fantastic. And uh, making sure that we keep pushing the issue with our gadget. And, uh, and just continue making our board look better and better. But guys, it feels pretty good to be back playing Robot. It's been a long time since it was decent, and I just really wanted to see how good it was. Is it really back? Can it actually carry uh, the offense without any help, without anything else on the board? Can it really do that? We are going to figure that out today. We'll combine out right there. Uh, another uh, stasis, but already we're doing pretty decently. And stasis, we're having some pretty decent luck with stasis just keeping right there in the front. We are one away. There it is from our 10th merge. He's already got his robot at max. I had to double check that. Uh, but now we got ours to four. We've got another warlock coming up. And, uh, and I think we've got a pretty decent opportunity to either take out Warlock before it hits us, or merge something so that Warlock at least doesn't take away a unit and we can merge before anything actually happens. But also, if you guys want to catch me live, I do live stream every Friday, 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. We're also trying to stream on Sundays. Definitely come on by. We are live on Twitch as well as on YouTube, so make sure you guys are following me on YouTube or on Twitch because we are going to be making that switch eventually and i don't want you guys to miss out i know you've heard it before but you're gonna hear it again no matter what so definitely check that out if you haven't all ready but we've got some pretty good opportunities here we can combine out that way i don't want to just keep on combining out all of our robots even though that seems like the only play so i'm going to try and avoid combining out a ton of robots here um yeah why don't we do some of these guys we can do that we can do our gadget do another one here now i don't feel so bad because we just copied it just combine that out combine that out not perfectly ideal but not the end of the world we can do that we can go down here do another uh stasis upgrade we've got a mime so we're again very close to that next merge which would be 15 i'm gonna do rank twos 
which we've got that right there. And we actually have um, Bedlam coming up next, which could be very, very interesting. 26 seconds. I'm interested to see if we both get switched, if I get switched at all, if he doesn't get switched. We might be able just maybe could be able to get to 20 merges before it happens. Let's uh, let's see what we can do, can we? There's 20 merges. There is 20 merges. Another gadget. We're actually pretty close. I don't know if we'll take this out. Let's see. Before I finish my train of thought, 400. Nope, we are not going to take this out. We also don't have any mana. Um, I don't even remember what I was going to say. Pretty close to something. Whatever I was going to say, I'm sure it was brilliant. Any rank 4 anythings? Let's just do that. We can do that. We can, uh... Do we get to 20? We got to 20 merges already, huh? Wow. Nice. So, yeah. Let's just do that. Okay, we can do that. Give me a robot. That would have been so sweet. I don't know why I merged like that. That really didn't do anything. But, guys, this end game uh, should cater to us. It should cater to us. Not 100% positive if we're going to win this. Oh, I was going to say, we're getting really close to getting our gadget active ability. Not quite yet. We've got one more that we have to hit our gadget with. And then we can actually slow everything down. But we've got 20 seconds. It looks like our stasis is doing pretty good work. I'm going to try and build a little bit of mana. So maybe we can actually take a, take advantage of this next bedlam. And it's, kinda, kinda, it's kind of going to come down to RNG. Yes, we have slow, which I think is fantastic. I'll level up my stasis again. Stasis again. But it's going to kind of come down to RNG into what our board's going to look like after Bedlam's all done. So let's see. 1.2, 1.1, 1 mil, under a mil. Uh, let's just copy a couple of these because we can. 600, 500. I think we will take this out. Let's see if any of these high-ranking units can actually turn into something kind of cool. Not... Not yet. Not yet. But I think we are going to be able to take it out. Okay. So let's take a peek around our board. What does it look like here? Uh, I'll just do these. I'm going to do that. I'm going to copy that guy. Uh, let's just combine that out. I'm actually going to combine this out as well. Bummer. All right. Nope. That's not what I wanted. We got this. We've got to hit our gadget. I should have hit that before. For some reason, I thought that we might have been somewhere else or already had it done. Let's do that. Another stasis is great for us. He's only got Trickster. His board does look better, but I'm just hoping that our stasis can hold it off. We're taking out a Vortex right now, and the Banner Lord, he's hitting me with a good game. It's still going to be such an RNG, but I think we might have it. And right there, there is a victory. Hit him with a good game. That's absolutely how we wanted to play that at the end there. A bunch of bedlums switching us around. Uh, pretty fun game right there. Let's check out the stats. He's got a level 8. A little bit under, um, under me in terms of crit, but he's got a higher level everything else pretty much. Higher level robot, that's all that matters, and a higher level uh, trickster hero yeah i mean my my trickster is only level three four something like that let's jump into at least one more game i can definitely say that it feels weaker eee. um this is gonna be a tough game right off the bat it definitely feels a bit weaker but we were able to take it out so let's see if we could find anything useful here so this is probably one of the best decks right here that we're playing against. Um, so this should be a little bit interesting. He hasn't found a robot either, so that's good. Let's just do that for right now. We're going to have to try and still get to five merges. I think that's the best thing that we can do right now. Um, but we're going to have to be very, very careful. Because with that clock of power, that does a lot against us. Slowing down that attack speed, all of a sudden we've got no damage coming out of our robots. And it would be really, really ugly. So I'm spam tapping my gadget. I really got to make sure that our gadget is getting as much use out of it as possible. And already his board looks amazing. And my board looks 
tragic what's going on here okay we got a bunch of these guys let's at least just copy these guys out i guess we'll just do that we'll do that i guess i'll do that as well we can copy that so now we at least have a couple of people attacking and, uh, and if we can actually get a couple of rank ones there's a rank one robot i'll do another one there why not i'll do another one there why not and uh, we got a couple of Stacys as well. But we're in an awkward position with Tribunal where we want to combine out, but we also need to survive. <laughs> so there's a merge right there. There's a merge right there. We don't have any more rank ones, so we're going to do that. Let's see. We can do 20 seconds is brutal. All right. So I think we just got to chalk it up to we're not going to lose right now, but... We're definitely not in a great spot. You can tell that his cards are definitely higher. His things are getting buffed right and left. We've got five seconds. He's taking things out. I have no idea what merge rank he's at, but clearly he's doing better. And he's only got two rank threes and a rank two when I have two rank threes and two rank twos. But he's got, he's got clock and I don't. So that's the reasoning. Let's just do this and we're going to do that. And uh, we can do that as well. Can we actually take this guy out? We're almost at five. So he's actually at eight merges. Oh my gosh. How did he get to eight merges so quick? He's playing this way better than me. If you guys want to learn how to play robot, watch him. Because he's just combining out rank three summoners right and left. And getting a rank four robot. This is a gully. The only thing that can be our saving grace is maybe we can do a little bit more damage than him. Because we've got a gadget. I'm just going to have to do that. Because we, we desperately need uh, some more damage from our board. So we are at our fifth rank. We've got a number of summoners. I guess we'll level up our robot right here. It's kind of tough because we want to use our mana um, elsewhere. Just buying units and whatnot. At least it's Warlock next. So Warlock is... You want our board full anyway. I'm trying to fill my board and Warlock... You want your board full so like... You know, we'll take the small victories, no matter what the, you know, no matter how big, how small, we want a, a victory is a victory, so we'll take that. But we're trying to go through this guy. Our Stacys are actually helping us out a ton right here. We've got a decent amount of robots on our field now. We've got another Stasis. We're jamming on the, the gadget here. Let's get our robot up again, see if I can do a little extra damage again. That fifth merge rank is splash now, rather than before it had to go to ten. So that's that's a massive difference from us. But this is pretty this is pretty ugly. So 17 seconds again. I don't think we're gonna lose right now, but, <laughs> but it's not pretty, guys. It's certainly not pretty. We're gonna have to combine out in some sort of way when Warlock comes down. We're trying to take out that mini boss. We're kind of clumping them together really nicely. And we're getting a little bit of mana. We got 500 mana now. He missed his trickster right there. Let's see what we can combine out and try to take out this Warlock. 600 to go through. Uh, and we did merge one right there. 500. We're taking it out so slowly. Um, but at least maybe every time he comes down, we can just keep on merging. And our board's not going to be terrible. And I'm just going to do that. A rank 4 is great. Uh, 450 to go through. I don't know if we take this out or not. I don't even know if we should try to. Back up to 500. Because he's just going to keep on decimating my board. There's another robot. Help him out, robot. Down to 300. What was the lowest that we got it to? 340, 320, 400 and something. <laughs> Back below 400. <laughs> We're also getting no... Oh, what is that? A rank 3? Of course it's a rank 3. Back below 300 again. Can we get under 200? N nope. We didn't get below 200, but we're at 300. Back below 300. Nothing there. This is just decimating this board. And this is one of the issues with running stasis. Because it slows everything down and gives Warlock, for instance, another opportunity to hit us again and again and again and again. And it's taken out all these useful things on our board, which is just tragic. Uh, and his board looks much better. It, we've got a rank 4. He's got a rank 4. 4 rank 3s. It's not looking pretty, fellas. But Tamer's actually not bad. Tamer isn't terrible. Let's try our best to get to a higher ranking something. I also want to try and fill my board, of course. We don't got a ton of mana. This is an uphill battle in every sense of the word. So... 
I'm just spam tapping here. The one good thing that's happening is that we actually have, we had the opportunity to uh, get our gadget pretty ranked up because it, everything took so long. So that's kind of nice. <laughs> But it does, it's, it's not looking good. It's not, we're taking that out. Tamer's next. I don't even think we're going to be able to take out Tamer. The, uh, the, tri the not Tribunal, the Trickster plus the Clock of Power combination with the, uh, he's just doing, he's doing work. There's 10. Oh, and there is an L. Level 18 Trickster. Are you kidding me? Hit him with the good game. Let's check out the stats. Level 8 Robot's not too crazy. Level 8. Teen Trickster is rather crazy, and uh, 2455 crit, and of course one of these <clears throat> one of these guys aren't gonna hit me with a good game back because why why would he? Little bit difficult right there. Little bit difficult. I think this is a great example of kind of what a deck that you could put together would look like. A level seven stasis, a level seven robot. Maybe a different hero would have been a little bit better in there. I don't even know. My trickster is just kind of a low level, so if it was at least a level five, I think I might use it. Gadget level one. Eh, we never actually got the opportunity to use its active ability, her active ability. So nothing really happened right there. But you can see on the ladder, robot is officially back. All the games that we saw in today's video, I played robot every time, and we played against robot every time. So hey. Bit of fun. Definitely try this deck out. It feels it feels good to be playing Stasis again. It used to be all over the meta. Now maybe uh, maybe it'll have a little bit of a resurgence. But that's going to be the end of this YouTube video, guys. If you enjoyed, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll check you guys out in tomorrow's video.